Hey, happy Saturday, everybody. It's Roxanne. Oh, excuse me. Something in my eye. <laughs> it's Roxanne at home here in Arizona, and I'm in my spare bedroom, the one I'm trying to get cleaned up for my daughter, the one that used to be my office, my jewelry room, my craft room, the junk room, everything. Um, so I've been working on it little by little by little. Um, so it seems like everything's out in the middle of the floor right now. I did get, um, most of these two cabinets, um, uh, bookshelves here cleaned out. Um, there's still a few things left in there, but some of that is stuff that my daughter wanted. That was my husband's, that little car, the little Pac-Man game, a Nelly Furtado CD. That was the first, I think she said that was the first concert her dad took to her took her to. And what else? What's the other thing back there? Oh, his little spam can. My husband loves spam. Somebody gave this to him and he had it on his desk at work. It's just his little spam can. He kept this all the time. So, um, these are a few things that my daughter wanted of his. So they're still here waiting for her when she comes. Um, I am going to today tackle the two, um, cabinets that I have craft supplies in. Um, a lot of it's probably going to get donated because I really don't have the time, energy, or desire to do crafting. But there's also other stuff in those drawers besides just all craft stuff. But I've got several boxes in here. One of them is going to be a donate box. And so everything that I'm going to donate is going to go in there. I also do have like some important paperwork and stuff that I'm going to need to find a new home for. Because um, it really doesn't belong in here. So uh, I thought we'd take you along, kind of show you what's going on here. Let me switch this around. Um, so yeah, it's a mess. There's boxes, there's copper. Uh, that was all fully yarn. So I've got all the yarn out ex except for on top of it, those bins also have yarn in them and those will get moved over into the closet and my bedroom. And that's where my desk was. Um, you can see where I used to put my feet up on the wall. <laughs> um, and these are the two cabinets that I'm going to be going through today. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and put this um, down and set it up. And we'll see what we got in here. All right. Let me put, pause you for a minute and get it, everything set up. Okay. Yeah, I'm down on the floor. I had to go get me a trash bag. Because I figure there's probably going to be trash that needs to be thrown away too. And then I've got my boxes back here for keep and throw away. So I'm going to start with in the drawers and then I'll do the top of those cabinets. And we'll go from there. And by the way, it's 109 out today. <laughs> uh, I don't know if fall will get here this year. We generally don't have much of a fall. But let me move camera over. Yeah, you can see the mess back behind there. All right, let's see. Let's start with the bottom drawer. Okay. Oh, this was eh, nothing I really need. This was from when I had my back surgery. We kind of kept an eye, not my back surgery, but my neck surgery. We kind of kept uh, some papers about how I was feeling and what meds I needed to take and when. I don't need that anymore. Um, this is a little journal that only has a couple of pages. So we can take those out and then I will have a new journal. Live Life Inspired. This was a Weight Watchers journal when I tried doing Weight Watchers and failed. A uh, birthday card from my mom from I don't know when. Not pretty though. Look at that one. Very pretty. 
And my paparazzi. Maybe somebody on the group will want to buy that. Just an empty notebook. Another empty notebook. Farmer's insurance, you know. Okay, I know it's a good amount of paper. Maybe I can... Maybe I can put, like, some kind of sticky paper over that because I really want no memory of that place. Um, it's too hard. It's too hard. Wheels. Um, photo print paper. What's in this bag? Oh, for yard sales. Some, um, like, pre-printed um, dollar and cents amounts, money amounts. Um, and this was, oh, this was our Cassie dogs. I wonder if my daughter would want that. And some more notebooks. Notebooks, notebooks, notebooks. Okay, so these notebooks are going to go into a keep bucket. So, whoa. So I've got a bin right here for keep stuff. Oh, that's a nice chain. Put that with something. Okay. Do you guys... All right, let me show you something here. These plastic bins... I don't know what it is, but the bottom drawers never just slide in. Like, these upper drawers, they just slide right in. But these bottom ones never do. And I have to, like, push them double like that. Do you guys have that? any of these that have that same problem? Seems like such a pain in the butt. All right, this was material when I was doing COVID masks. Um, let me get a box here. This was for COVID masks. It was the uh, filter to like put inside the COVID masks. We had um, a group of ladies here during COVID when it first struck and we had, I don't know, several hundred ladies um, doing all different phases of making masks for the local health healthcare people and stuff like that. And we made over 24,000 masks in like an eight week period. Um, some of us just rolled, some of us sewed, we rolled kits. So the kit would include the material, um, the, um, some, uh, pipe cleaners and, um, the, the, uh, string for the ties. And so we would roll those. Some people would iron, some people would do different things. So it was a really big task and really big and we we did a an amazing thing um and really helped a lot of people so it was very cool to be a part of that some hibiscus car stickers i don't think i need any more of those so we'll put those in the giveaway and then these are stickers for journaling this one's like all kitchen stuff um All kinds of kitchen stuff, little avocados and stuff. I'm not sure if I'll want to keep those. So I'll keep them just in case. All these big stick books. If I don't want them, my daughter-in-law might. So another thing of journaling, happy planner stickers. These are some nice stickers. Some of these I'll keep. Some of these will go away into the giveaway. This whole drawer seems to be stickers, though. Um, those are good for journaling. These are trading card pages. I don't need those. These are Christmas address stickers, which I don't need. Some more blingy stickers. Some more flower ones. Some inspirational ones. I'll keep what it... Ugh. 
tapey stuff on there. That'll get thrown away. Butterflies. Do I want butterflies? No, not really. So those will go in there. Oh, look at those blingy ones. Those are pretty. Keep the nose. More of the photo pages, trading card pages. I don't need those. Owls. Little owls. Nah, I won't use those. Um, and I don't think I'll make use that one. Um, well, this was a devotion book. Okay, we'll keep that. My Sun City West sticker. Little um, succulent stickers. Those are cute. Those I will definitely use. Okay. These... I won't use markers. I have colored pencils and gel pencils. And I tried using markers when I was doing um, some adult coloring and stuff. But I don't think that it came out real well. So that's going to go in the giveaway box as well. Uh, just a little thing to keep. More flower stickers. Some pretty butterfly ones, some gemstones, letters, puppy dogs, trash, more flowers, more gems, more rollies. You know, I am not going to be using these photo papers so those are going to go in the giveaway too because my printer doesn't do well with that keep the bling keep the triangle these are just some different papers that are good for journaling these might be good for doing some bible journaling so i'll keep those some more bling oh like little fern leaf ones Little baby footprints. Those are cute. Some more like butterflies. I don't want those. I don't know why I bought butterflies. Not something I use. Not something I'm really into. What are these? Oh, just old mail and some more blings. All right. Oops. Wheels. The wheels I'm going to put back in the drawers. So that I know where the wheels are. All right, drawer two down. I don't want to get up on my knees yet. Let's go into this drawer. All right, got these little mesh bags, pumpkins. I don't really decorate for fall. I got these for decorations for um, doing my jewelry displays, but now that I'm no longer actively selling jewelry and doing that kind of stuff. I'm just trying to get rid of the stuff I have. These might be fun to keep though. Yeah, I'll keep those. The, the pumpkins, I don't think I need to keep the pumpkins. Nah, I don't need to keep the pumpkins. There's some more leaves. These remind me of aspen leaves and I sure do miss Seeing aspens from Colorado. Some little glass, sea glass. That might be nice to do something with. This, look at this big thing. This is all crochet patterns and some crochet books. So definitely keeping that because I still crochet this little decorative stuff I don't need trash an old journal cover don't need that one and this stuff is what is this stuff trash trash some keto recipes don't need some nope empty folders More crochet patterns. 
keto tacos and a pizza casserole and some soups. Eh, maybe I'll keep those. Those might be good. And then this, when I left Colorado, I had a friend that was into that whole 30 and she printed me up the whole thing, a shopping list and recipes and stuff like that on how to do that whole 30. And I never really looked at it. So maybe it's something, maybe it's something I need to look into. Another thing here where this darn drawer, look at that. It won't close. Got to push. Hold on. Oh, that hurts. All right. You know, it doesn't seem like once I get in here and start working on this stuff, the task doesn't seem as bad. <laughs> I don't know. What is this? This is... Oh, these are my surgery notes from my neck surgery. I might, I might need to keep those. I don't know, but I might, so I will. I don't, I don't like those flowers. So those will be given away. Uh, squishy envelopes. I have another bag for those. Trash. Zip ties. Can always use those. More envelopes that are puffy. I used those to I use those to mail out jewelry to people. I was looking for this. I needed this to do. This is a Tupperware. Um and it the lid comes up here. I think, or it pops open. Can't remember. It seems to be stuck now, but it was supposed to be for being able to pour. So I think I'm going to put that in the kitchen. So not in the bag. Big thing for wrapping and moving. So we'll keep that. More. All right. This was my husband's medical stuff. And then this was some of my medical stuff. All right, I don't need to keep that. That can get shredded. Birthday card. From a girlfriend. Pretty card. Look at that one. Several years ago. All right. This one. Oh, special day organizer. I should use this so I can remember birthdays and pre-buy birthday cards. Yeah, I'm going to leave that out. I'm not boxing that up. I need to start using that. And here is a handmade card. I don't know if... No. That one, I don't know where I got that one, but it's a nice handmade card. So we'll keep that. Might want to use that. Um, there is a Father's Day card that never got used. More medical appointment stuff. Okay, that's stuff that can get shredded. Here's my paperwork. Oh, it's my computer pap papers. More wheels. I'll put them in here. What is this? Oh, it's a list from my sister of places that we visited at her place. And oh, I brought these out. These were some more cards. This one I believe was from my mother. Yep. Uh, it was a birthday present, birthday card. I might, these are like stuff, I might take those off and use them on some of my crafting because they're pretty. 
So I'll keep those. And what is this one? Oh, this one's so cute. Look how that you. Look at how that. It like opens up all different cute ways. You can like open it this way. Oh, am I showing you? Open it that way. Open it this way. And then I think it like opens up all the way. All kinds of cute ways. Look at that. I like that one. All right. Keeping that one. That was a handmade card. I believe that was from my, my best friend there. All right. We'll put that there. That's trash. Old. Old, old medical stuff. I don't know if I need to keep any of that. I'll see. My husband's medical stuff. I don't need to keep more of his medical stuff. Oh, there's so much junk in here. Why do I have all this? I don't even know. Oh, paperwork for my collar. This was my husband's stuff here. Medical. Yep. Don't need that. Husband's medical. Husband's medical. Old financial stuff that no longer is valid. A lot of shredding here. A lot of shredding. Insurance. Air mattress. I still have that. And, okay. Got a bunch of shredding stuff for that. All right. Top drawers. Oh, boy. How long is this? Almost 20 minutes. Are you guys bored yet? Look at the top drawer here, guys. Okay. So, are y'all bored yet? I hope. I don't know. I don't know. If maybe this isn't something y'all enjoy seeing. I don't know. It's another journal from I don't know when. Bunch more old paperwork. Sticker paper. It's like you can print different stickers on the paper. It's like clear. So here's the paper. It's just clear, and then you print the stickers, and you can cut them out. And let's see. More old bills that can be... This is pretty much... Oh, this comes out. Good. I think pretty much everything in here can get shredded. So what I might do, except for like that. And then this looks like a Bible. This can all be shredded. Oh, that's where that was. I had an old TV that I donated, but I didn't have the um, the remote to it. Here it is, but I've already donated and it's already gone, so I can just throw out that remote. Don't need that. Oh, these are good. 101 blessing cards. I should keep these by my bed. They're little cards that just have little blessings on them. For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you hope and a future. Jeremiah 29, 11. Clothe yourselves with compassion, kindness, humility, gentleness, and patience. Colossians 3, 12. I'm going to hang on to these and put these by my bed or with my other devotional stuff maybe have a word of the day. There's 101 blessings in there. So maybe I'll have a nice little word of the day. Pad that I can keep. Some Tupperware. Bring into the kitchen. Shredding stuff. Another empty journal. I 
a lot of empty journals. I like journals. I just never realized I had so many empty ones. Um, I wonder if these are still work. Bible highlighters. Um, put those with my Bible stuff. Tape. That's trash. I don't know what this is for. I don't know what this is for. I wonder if I should hang on to it just in case. Yeah, for now. What's this? Therapy dough. Oh, interesting. It's ocean scented. It's called pinch me therapy dough. It still smells. It's like silly putty. See that? It's like silly putty, but it's ocean scented. Oh, I like that. See what you find when you go through stuff? All right, that can go out. That's an old coaster I crocheted. I need to crochet some more good ones. <laughs> Little turtle sticky pads. It says, dude, dude. Jewelry cloths. I've been looking for those because my silver jewelry is starting to tarnish. Um, and this was something I crocheted to hold the um, doggy rolls, the, the doggy uh, plastic bags. So I need to put that on Copper's um, um, his leash. Sorry, can't think. This was a holder for a camera on a stick. I don't have that kind of camera, so it's not something I need. These are little um, lights, little LED string lights. Keep those. Some pictures. Let's see what these pictures are. Uh, that's me and my daughter. And that's me and my friend Jane. Oh, these were from Vegas when we went to see Foreigner. And that's my and my sister and my mommy. And, oh, this is a good one. Okay, this was just a few years ago. Um, before the kids had kids, before my son and his wife had kids. And there's my hubby. So that's a good one. <laughs> All right, I don't know if this one I'm going to get um, tagged for, but my girlfriend and I went to Vegas to go see Def Leppard in concert, and we were just shopping around some of the stores, and we found these cups. We didn't buy them, but we thought they were really cute. <laughs> so that was fun. And then some stuff with my sister. Old picture of my dad. My friend Monica. I'm going to keep all these. Oh, that's a really. Oh, I need to frame this one. This is a really nice one of me and hubby. Oh, this one's even better. This is me and hubby in Hawaii. So I got to frame some of these. So I am not going to put that in the box because I don't want to lose those. So I wish I would have had some of those for his memorial. Um, those would have looked good on the memorial thing that my daughter did up. Okay, some more Bible highlighters, a little purse. Okay. And let's put those over there. A little 31, like little wallet thing. That might come in handy someday. Another journal. Hey, Copper. What's up, buddy? Shipping labels. Oh, my box is getting full, guys. Another journal. More highlighters. Plug. Paperwork is all stuff that can get shredded. Ah, oh, I like this one. And some more, um, some more sticky notes that say "Beach, please." Yeah, keep those. This was this was a um, a remote charger thing, and it looks like it's, it's still got blue lights, so it still works. 
So I just need to charge that up. Maybe that's what that white thing is for, but I don't think so. But I'm going to hang on to that. And then got tape and some lotion. And the rest of this is just paperwork that can get shredded. So all that other paperwork that needed to be shredded is going in there too. And I, I have a, a shredder here at the house. And for me, there is something oddly satisfying about shredding paperwork. So that's what I'm going to do with that one. All right, that box is full and I have no more room for this next drawer, which is mainly all craft supplies. So it's probably all going to get donated. Um, and I'll go through that in a little bit. All right, so I know I'm not finished, but we are at almost 30 minutes of me doing like all this funny, crazy stuff. So I'm going to let y'all go. Um, I hope this can encourage you guys a little bit to start going through stuff just a little bit at a time my other one with cleaning my bathroom again this is just life and we do a little bit at a time I've been journaling um and in my journal I have been starting to write down what activities I did for the day what what I did to accomplish and do some cleanup work around the house and it's helping keep me doing stuff because I don't want to have a day where I don't have something written down. So um, I'm going to keep doing that and hopefully I'll be able to keep going with this. So, all right, guys. Um, yeah, sorry, this is so long, but I hope you uh, enjoyed it and I will talk to you soon. God bless you all. It's Roxanne at home here in Arizona. Take care, everybody. Bye.